hi hello welcome back to the channel this is balaji today i have a root cause analysis for you what is a root cause analysis if you ask it is where you are given a situation and you are expected to find why it happened or how it happened so i'll straight away go to the question for today and we'll try solving it so here's the question so it says the movie ticket booking on paytm app or paytm itself is down by 70% find out what happened consider yourself a product person at paytm and on one fine monday morning you are told that the movie ticket bookings on the app has dropped by 70% that is it was 27% earlier to 8% over the weekend run through on what all could be the possible root causes that could have caused a sudden drop so what do we do first we'll have to clarify what the question is asking so you can ask clarify questions on what does this mean or anything else if you are not sure of so my clarifying question would be first one uh, what does drop percentage define it so until earlier 27% of total successful transactions were from movie ticket bookings and over the weekend it fell to 8% so this is what the question is so let's put down a framework for identifying the possible issues so you're going to ask yourself why is it happening where is it happening so to answer the why it could be an internal issue within the paytm company it could be an external issue it could be a demographic issue maybe specific to some city some state or some region or sentiment and collateral damage i'll explain all the four of them later on in the slides but these are the basic uh, topics you're going to cover if you cover this you are essentially going to cover almost every possible issue that could have happened so going to the next slide so another question here is where is it happening so answering this slide essentially is going to give you an answer on if it's a technical glitch or non-technical glitch so let's try understanding what are we looking through so we are going to ask where is a drop seen so the drop could be in two places that is either the paytm web or the paytm app here in paytm i believe app is the most widely used platform but it's better to consider both the cases so here if if there's a equivalent drop in both paytm web and paytm app that is a 70 percent drop in both web and app equally we can come to a conclusion that it is not a technical glitch but a non-technical glitch but if it is happening only in the web or only on the app so we can uh, safely assume that one of the changes that has been made by the tech team would have affected this uh, would have caused this issue so considering if majority of the drop is seen in the web we can probably infer that it is caused by some glitch to the web browser that it is causing it to fall and also you can compare the ctr ctr is essentially the click through rate of uh, the users so if a button is clicked 100 times and its click through rate is 100 times so from pre uh, drop to after drop if you see the click through rate if the click through rate remains the same it means there's no change that has happened to the ui ux uh, and that is not affecting but if there's a massive drop in the click through rate of the movie icon on the web page that will give you a, a slight idea on the something is wrong here because that the user is not able to see the icon now it's coming down to the paytm app we can bifurcate this into if it is happening on ios or android so this will essentially give us an idea if it is happening on one separate version or both android and ios so if it is happening only on ios so we can just tell the ios team that the recent most upgrade that you push through is causing this downfall so essentially we can check the app version if it is a 0.1 versus 0.2 and 0.1 was the previous version where we had nominal amount of uh, bookings and version 0.2 has dropped 
so we can say that there whatever change was made in the point second version has caused the drop in the uh, bookings now let's look into the other uh, why it is happening so these could be possible reasons but it is better for us to check up all the possible reasons before we come to a conclusion maybe out of the 70 percent drop that is there maybe the 60 percent could have been caused by one issue and the other 10 percent could have been caused by another issue which happened at the same time so it's better we consider all the cases and then come to a conclusion on, on what could have happened so what is sentiment and collateral damage so it's something like it happened somewhere but i got impacted like for example before the movies uh, large movies got released the negative pr had been sh put up by the film crew and therefore people are not uh, coming down to watch the movie or taking a booking so that could have caused a drop or the movie that released targeted someone or something and it could have caused a sentimental issue on the uh, audience and they would have they would have decided not to watch or these customers who have been booking uh, booking uh, movie tickets on the app probably came through, came in through a campaign or an event and the campaign stopped and they left. I can relate this to something like how uh, Zomato has Zomato Gold for a year and probably people had been uh, ordering while they had Zomato Gold and when the Zomato Gold was stopped on one, sp one specific day all the people who were using Zomato Gold did not come back because they did not have a upper hand in booking. So it's something like, like that could have happened. Or uh, COVID such pandemic scares because that uh, somewhere in Delhi there were some two three cases initially and entire uh, India got shut down. So that could have happened. And uh, going down to the next one is demographic issue. It could be something like age or gender or location specific issues something like uh, state holiday and elections probably like five states in india are having elections at the same time and all the theaters are probably closed or they're not operational and those five cities uh, five states would have been major contributor to ticket bookings on paytm and that could have caused a drop or national calamities like flood in one part of the city uh, fl flood in one region of uh, India and uh, people would have not wanted to go to movies or uh, probably an internet outrage in majority of the states like, like for example the entire Kashmir had no internet for a long time and something like that would have happened and that could have caused a drop not telling that this would have caused the entire 70% drop but probably contributing to one or two percent drop the next being external issues so these are incidents that directly affect the event but it is happening outside the system the system being paytm so probably there's a rival giving attractive discounts a chain of cinemas for example pvr shut down or uh, the same pvr chain pulled out of the paytm platform and they are now no longer available and that was giving the ma major amount of uh, traffic to the uh, app and because they are not there that could have caused a 70 percent drop or a new competitor to enter the market say for example we have uh, book my show we have uh, paytm insider etc or something like that would have happened and that would have caused a sudden drop in ticket booking so these are the uh, why reasons from external point of view if you are going to look at the internal point of view let's understand the funnel Funnel is essentially how the user is going to go through the app from the beginning to the end and all the pages the uh, user is going to traverse through. So first is the user lands on the home page of the app. Then the user chooses the movie icon. You see this here. He will click on this. It comes down to the movie page. The then the user is going to click on which movie the user is going to watch choose his seats and finally check out so this is the essential flow on how every user is going to go through and we'll find out what could be the possible reasons at each funnel that could have caused a drop 
so user enters the platform that is the paytm home page here searches for the movie tab that is uh, whatever shows movie to enter the movie page what could have happened the movie section could have been pushed down to the end of the page that the user did not see the movie icon or it could have been pushed to uh, a scrolling place for example you see this movie icon here and you see this event ticket here probably it could have been hidden like this that the user will have to scroll to the right and then find out movie tickets probably a ui ux issue and that could have caused uh, the user to un uh, probably assume that paytm is no more selling movie tickets and therefore will go and buy it somewhere else that could be an assumption and ui ux pay, plays a major role in such uh, such apps and uh, probably after if the movie icon is not moved anywhere and if there's no issue there probably there's a page load issue or page load crash or there's a promotional content binding the uh, icons probably suddenly there's a pop-up and uh, because there's a pop-up the movie icon movie icon was not seen and people just moved away so this could have happened it's majorly uh, around ui ux which is going to cause issues like this then if there is no such issue then the person chooses the movie and while choosing the movie uh, the possible issues being uh, the preferred cinema hall is not there that is probably like pvr inox have pulled out of the app uh, expected movie is not there uh, maybe there is one movie large movie releasing in the weekend like say example rrr but in the specific regions it's been banned for some reason say for example some states in the north it's been banned and therefore it's not being played and that could have caused an issue because uh, that was the only movie the weekend or the preferred language of the movie is not there because taking example of rrr rrr is a telugu movie but people might have wanted to watch it in hindi but the hindi version is not available in the city so people are not watching and also there are no other movies in the same weekend because a huge movie like rrr released and every other movie backed out of the weekend so that could have caused an issue now if that is not an issue the person selects the seats required and what could have happened Prob uh, probably that in the previous page uh, the person would have chosen for three seats but uh, after moving to the seat selection page he might have wanted only two seats and uh, for this he'll have to go back and change it to two and come back and select two seats but if the back button is not available uh, the entire flow stops and it has to be redone from the beginning that causes uh, uh, causes a dissatisfaction among the customers and they'll stop buying or stop processing through the flow or uh, proceed button is not visible that is moving to the next page is not visible this could happen at any stage but I put it down here uh, because it's a technical glitch but this button not visible and uh, back button is not visible is possibly an issue at any any stage and the checkout page what happens in the checkout page uh, the receipt is shown that is the final amount and uh, this is where the major drop off happens so what happens is uh, as an Indian I would likely check how much uh, is Paytm charging me and I'll go to some other app and check how much is the other app charging me if uh, if one of these two apps are giving me a lower amount I'm going to go with the app that is giving me a lower amount or there could be an unwelcome additional charge like uh, platform charges or uh, something like uh, donations uh, and etc so any additional charges other than specified charge for the seat if it is charged people will become unhappy and that could cause a drop in conversion rate and the last one being making a payment making a payment is where you click on the submit button and make a payment here the possibilities could be uh, a on the user end b on the app end also so on the user end uh, the person not might not have much money 
because uh, uh, it could be the end of the month and people would not have uh, enough money and they'll just realize that they don't have enough money and uh, stop purchasing a ticket or uh, incorrect uh, card number would have been entered incorrect card number would have been entered when there's some issue with the credit card company or uh, they the credit card number and CVV number are not accepted possibly technical glitch from the credit card company or uh, coming down to the coupons uh, there might not be an eligible coupon to get a discount or the coupon that the user already has gained from outside is not getting applied and because they're not getting the coupon getting applied they might stop the flow and not book a ticket so these are the possible reasons that i've put down and could have been uh, a possible reason there could be other possible reasons also which i might have not put down if there's anything else that you think i might have missed do put it down in the comments i'll be happy to uh, accept it and uh, this root cause analysis is a question that is asked in a product analyst interview or a product manager interview so if there's any product analyst or product management interview that your friends are preparing for do feel free to uh, share it with them and uh, yes thank you